Prince George's adorable outfit, for his baby brother's christening was inspired by the one his father wore on his own sibling's special day, more than 30 years ago. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's eldest child looked smart as a button in his white shirt with a Peter Pan collar, and blue piping to match his shorts. And keen-eyed royal watchers might already have spotted its similarity to the outfit his father, Prince William, wore on his own brother Harry's christening day, in 1984. Prince Louis was christened in the Chapel Royal at St. James's Palace on Monday afternoon. Watched by his proud parents Kate and William, Prince George, their sister Princess Charlotte, and a small group of immediate family and friends. It wasn't the first time Prince George's wardrobe has included nods to his father and his family's history. At Princess Charlotte's christening in 2015, he wore a virtual replica of the red and white set William wore to meet Prince Harry, for the first time at St. Mary's Hospital in London. And one month earlier, Prince George had made his debut on the Buckingham Palace balcony for Trooping the Color, dressed in the very same pale blue romper his father had worn in the same spot over 30 years earlier. George was held up by William for a better view on the day, in a striking echo of a 1984 photograph of the now Duke of Cambridge, in the arms of his own father. The adorable outfit is a family heirloom. Now a loving family of five, the Cambridge's acknowledgement of tradition has always been evident at family occasions. Following the service yesterday, guests gathered at Clarence House to enjoy a private tea hosted by William and Kate, which included slices of the couple's wedding cake from their nuptials, in 2011. After their first child was born, they made the personal decision to have Prince George baptized at the Chapel Royal, in St. James's Palace rather than at Buckingham Palace, like other future monarchs. The intimate venue holds special resonance for William and his family, as it is where his late mother Diana's body lay in rest ahead of her funeral in 1997, to allow her relatives to pay their last respects.